swimming at the coast is a favorite pastime, and here we got some fish heads from Mount Pleasant Seafood. And Bill, please do the honors for me, would you? All right, we're going to load up this crab trap with these fish heads and uh, just force them right in here to give us a nice, just a beauty here. It's a good looking salmon head. We'll stuff that in there, and then we take our trap cover and lock it down real good like so, and we're going to drop it in the water. We just drop that boy right down the center. Come to me, little crabs. The trap's been all night. Let's see what we got this morning. Yeah. Got a good, uh, good group of blue crabs and even unusually uh, one stone crab, which is not something you see real often. You'll note here it only has one claw. That means it's been caught before and somebody threw the uh, crab back after picking one claw, which is the way they're properly harvested, and then they regenerate that claw. And uh, all you eat of a stone crab is the claw. We'll dump these out in just a second and then have us some crabs. Okay, what we've done is grab one of the crabs with some tongs and I'm going to get his swimmers from the back and then I'll let him hold on to that one see as he seems to want it and break off this pincher and that's good eating so we'll have that one and we break off this pincher now we've got a crab that ain't going to bite you one way to do this and they're not quite as active is to throw some ice on them but uh, we're making it a little more exciting today then you take his underside and peel back this piece right here Get your thumb right in the back, hold the shell, and you clean the shell away from the crab. And you clean off the lungs or gills of the crab and the insides that are not really edible. Break the crab in half, throwing again away the, I want to say the guts of the crab, because that's what it is. What you've got then when you finish is two beautiful pieces of white crab meat that uh, you can steam or boil or however you prepare it and then pick it and uh, mighty good eating right here in Charleston, South Carolina. My favorite way to cook the crabs is to steam them and to steam them I use a steamer pot and I use a can of beer. And for every layer of crabs you want to salt them and the secret here is the Old Bay seasoning. This is how they do it in Maryland. And another layer. And some more salt and some more Old Bay seasoning. And then the top on for about 15 minutes. You can cook them whole, but when you get them to the table, they're much easier to eat if you've already cleaned them first. After the crabs have steamed for about 15 minutes, they're ready for picking. All you need is a little lemon butter sauce. And uh, the real kind of sewers start off by sucking those legs. Mmm, sweet meat. And it can't get any better than this. This is Catherine Deal, Home Chef.